Um, Inisan? Yes, what is it? Well, about that day, have you remembered anything? No, and I do not want to think about it. I get chills thinking about it even now. Oh. By the way, Fukuhara-san was looking for you. Huh? Fukusan is? Huh? Um, Ryo-san, I... What is it, Fuxa? I'm sorry. I told Ine-san. What did you tell her? I told her what you're doing. I told her everything I know. You what? I just couldn't help myself. And Inesan needed to know. Fuxa. I'm really sorry. It's okay. Fuxa, do you know anything about the Phoenix Mirror? The Phoenix Mirror? My father may have had it. No, I've never heard him say anything about a mirror. Really? Inesan might know something about it, though. Okay, let's go ask her. Ah, Inesan. Fukusan talks very loud, doesn't he? Huh? I just heard the two of you talking. We were talking? Yes, I'm sorry. It was rude of me to eavesdrop. Oh, it's okay. No, it wasn't. But then, who could tell the son of Iwao Hazuki to stay out of trouble? I hate to say it, but... I feel like I'm letting your father down. I... I'm sorry for making you worry so much. Ryo-san, I don't know if this will help or not. But there was one thing I recall. It wasn't that long ago when... Azuki-sensei went to an antique shop to have something stored for him. My father did what? I don't know what it was, but he said it was very important. Antique shop. Ryo! Nozomi. Making any progress? Yeah. I found something my father left for me. Your father? Yeah. See you later. Yeah. Nozomi. Ryo, take care of yourself. Sure. Well, hello there. Hello. Shinkichi-san. Hello, Ryo. Where's the antique shop? The antique shop? You mean Oishi-san shop? Yes, that's it. Hey, Ryo, you forgot where it is? Uh, it's just... What's with you? All right, it's across from the lunchbox stand. Ah, that's right. Thanks. Anytime. Kurita-san. Yo, how are you? 
What's going on? I'm on my way to the antique shop. Over near the convenience store. They sell nice goods, but too expensive. I see. I saw a nice vase there a while back. Thought I'd buy it for Yuriko, but it was too expensive for me. That's too bad. Excuse me. Oh. That's a delightful sound, don't you agree? It was made especially for that butterfly woman. You know Madam Butterfly, don't you? You... Your Hazuki Sensei's... Oh my, that was a terrible thing. Your father... Ah, I was holding something at Sensei's request. Hmm, just where did I put it, huh? Oh yes, it was very important, so I put it here. He'd asked me to polish and look after it for him. For my father? It's given to the Hazuki heirs once they turn 18. I gather this antique has been passed down from generation to generation. Father. If there's anything I can do for you, please let me know. Hazuki Sensei was always there for me when I needed him. Was there anything else that he asked you to hold for him? Anything else? Like a mirror, called the Phoenix Mirror. A Phoenix Mirror? Hmm... Sorry, I don't know of any mirror. Well, that's okay. Thank you very much.